Liam Hill sponsors IFL TV. I'm the man to beat Daniel Dubois. We're going to sleep. So this is Scotty Silver for IFL TV in association with MTK Global. I'm here with the one and only Mr. Ryan Rhodes and Ryan's right hand man, right, Mr. Man. Steve Bailey. How are you doing, guys? <laughs> good guys. Very good. Very, Very good. good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back Hi, in the, the sun again. again. We love it. We absolutely love it. We don't, we're not fortunate enough in Sheffield to get this kind of weather, but you know it's always nice when we come abroad and come and support Jono on his events, and uh, we're here again. Well, I can't keep up with you. I think you was in the States last week. I, I think you were, was you sort of ringside with Canelo? Was you trying to pitch? I wish I'd have been ringside. Uh, I, I went out there, I booked it for my wife's 40th, and luckily the month after I booked it, they announced the Canelo and Jacobs fight, so I was really fortunate enough to, to be out in Vegas for the atmosphere, for the occasion. Um, and, and what a fight, what a fight. Um, so, yeah, I've, I was lucky because I was in New York as well for the Rocky Fielding fight, so. Yeah, yeah. Life's good at the moment. Yeah, at the minute. <laughs> now, you guys with your own gym as well, uh, yeah. back in Sheffield. That seems to be going from strength to strength. I mean, I keep seeing you popping up on the TV, various boxers as well, various promotions going on. I mean, how good is it at the moment? We're flying at minute, Steve, aren't we? We're doing really, really well. We've got, uh, we've got um, Samuel Mason's uh, fighting, defending his English title against Kay Prosper, uh, late September, early August. Over the last few couple of days, we've just announced uh, one of our young lads, Razak Najib, has just got an EU title uh, in Spain. Um, got, so we're travelling to Spain for, for him to challenge for the EU title. The gym's going from strength to strength. Steve's a massive part of a 26RR Fitness. Um, Steve not only helps me with all my pros and, and, and trains the pros, but Steve controls the amateurs of, of 26RR ABC. So... Steve's fully, fully on board with everything. And I saw you've got, uh, I think it's an IBO World Title shot thing coming up in July or August time as well. Yeah, we're right? working alongside Steffi Bull. Um, we're doing a promotion on the 19th of July at the Magna Centre. Uh, Terry Harper, we've managed to get her an IBO World Title fight. She could be Britain's first lady world champion. Uh, I know Nicola Adams, but she's Irish. But, but Terry Harper is absolutely flying the, flying the flag for, for British boxing and, and we, we're proud to be associated with Steffi. She's great, she's great. Terry really Harper. good? Yeah, very good to watch, very yeah. slick. Well, I've, I've got to say, the, the boxing scene up north, it just seems to be flourishing. I mean, obviously you've still got the Ingle Gym, which you know all about. Absolutely. Ryan. You've got your gym, then you've got Glim Rose doing wonders as well with the, the Sheffield unit with Tommy Frank and all that. Well, Glim, uh, sorry, Steve was, was, was a part of Glim's gym for 20-odd for years, 20 odd I years. believe. Yeah, yeah. Tommy Lovely Frank, one of my well, guys, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. I mean, is there friendly rivalry between the gyms in the area? I mean, listen, it's always a little bit of banter between old gyms, but we're all, we all, I'd like to think we all, you know, we all support each other. Uh, we, we love it when, when, our, when our Sheffield lads do well against other, um, other towns and, and, and places like that. Um, but it, it's great for Sheffield, you know. Sheffield's been a, a, a city where it's just been a conveyor belt of champions turning over, turning over. I don't know whether it's something in the water in Sheffield or what, but it's all, we've been lucky enough in Sheffield to turn out great fighters and great champions. Brilliant. And, of course, we're here in Lanzarote at the moment. Seem to be more and more training camps in Lanzarote and Fuerteventura Aventura with all the Ingle guys, of course, here with, with John O'Brien as well. It seems like gone are the days where a lot of people were just going to Vegas they seem to be doing the shorter four-hour route and coming here now, which is good for us and good for you guys. Listen, it's four hours to Lanzarote, you know, and uh, the facilities John O's got, it's, it's everything we need. The sun, the gym, um, you know, the facilities, it, it's great training. You, you, you don't mind getting up at six, seven o'clock in the morning when the sun's out. It's, it's gorgeous and uh, it's, it's somewhat what we really, really like. 
You like doing Stevie? Yeah. yeah. And I've got to say, Steve, how good was this guy? Oh, really one of close. one of the probably one of the most famous British guys not to win a world title. Would you agree? Yeah, alongside Earl Graham, yeah, one of one of the best British boxers who turned out that didn't actually win a world title. But hey, listen, you know, I've been doing this since I was eight year old. Um, and I've never enjoyed me boxing as much, you know. I mean, Ryan's mentioned I was with Glen Rose for a, a long time, and we had some good times. But I'm really enjoying the boxing now. Yeah, the coaching's, you know, I'm, I'm having a great time, and it's mostly down to this guy. And for anyone that's uh, sort of watching this, the new gen of boxing fans, if you ever get a chance to watch Ryan against Jamie Moore, that was an absolute humdinger <laughs> of a fight. That, that was. That's a, if anybody asks me about Ryan, that's a, that's a fight I point him to. I'll say, you know, get that up on YouTube. Have a look at Ryan and Jamie Moore. Uh, you know, up and down, you know, backwards and forwards, Jimmy Moore, then Ryan, then Jimmy, then back to Ryan, and obviously Ryan wins it in the end, so, yeah, great fight. It, it was a fantastic fight. Well, guys, I should imagine you're getting a bit hungry. Have a fantastic night here, and enjoy the rest of your stay in Lanzarote, and thanks for giving a few minutes of your time as well. Thank you. Thanks again. Cheers, mate. William Hill sponsors IFL TV. I'm the man to beat Daniel Dubois. We're going to sleep.